triggering mechanisms and impact analysis of large-scale hydrothermal explosions in Yellowstone National Park. A case study of seismic linkages Hydrothermal explosions at Yellowstone result from rapid steam flashing of pressurized, near-boiling fluids in shallow subsurface cavities. These sudden phase changes can fragment rock and eject mud, water, and blocks over tens to hundreds of meters, producing craters that persist in the landscape for millennia. Although many explosions show no clear precursors, earthquakes and transient, Stress or permeability changes can act as triggers by altering pressure, opening fluid pathways, or collapsing weak caps over shallow reservoirs. This narrative synthesizes the physical mechanisms, documents a recent Yellowstone case Biscuit Basin, July 23, 2024, evaluates seismic linkage scenarios, and outlines the likely impacts and monitoring implications for park safety and scientific preparedness Background. What is a hydrothermal explosion? Hydrothermal explosions occur where shallow, steam, and liquid-saturated reservoirs sit at temperatures and pressures near the liquid vapor boundary. If pressure is suddenly reduced, for example by rapid leakage, fracturing, or removal of overburden, liquid flashes to steam and expands explosively, rock is fragmented and ejected creating breccia deposits and craters that can range from a few meters to kilometers across. Yellowstone hosts numerous large explosion craters, many preserved beneath lake sediments and on land, and the geologic record shows major events over the Holocene. The physical triggers, how explosions get started. Heat triggering mechanisms fall into three, sometimes overlapping, categories, rapid pressure loss or depressurization, sudden removal of confinement e.g., collapse of a cap, opening of a fracture network causes near boiling water to flash to steam, producing a pressure surge and rock fragmentation. Hydraulic forcing and water loading, unloading. Rapid influx of cold water from heavy precipitation, melting, or lake level changes or sudden drainage can perturb temperature, pressure equilibria and destabilize shallow reservoirs. Seismic or mechanical triggering, earthquakes local or regional can change stress, induce brittle failure, unclog or open conduits and produce transient pore pressure. Changes, these effects can be enough to tip a hydrothermal system past its stability threshold. Laboratory and field syntheses and geologic mapping at Yellowstone indicate earthquakes are a plausible and documented trigger in many geothermal systems, though not every explosion is preceded by detectable local seismicity.